Hi there, welcome to Smart and Secure. So I'm just going to explain a bit about our CCTV camera ranges, uh, just to explain the features and benefits and just what you can expect from each camera. Uh, we use High Vision, the world's biggest CCTV manufacturer. Uh, the reason we use them is they've got all the cutting edge technology and we get our engineers trained directly by them and certified. So you know that from a customer point of view, when our installer comes out, they know exactly what they're doing when it comes to getting the absolute best out of these cameras. Um, there's also a 72 hour training in period we do post installation whereby we adjust the night vision settings, the backlighting, the shutter speeds, the level of light that's coming out of the camera when it's dark. Um, all of those things can really improve the image quality that you're getting from that camera at night versus it just being left on the automatic settings that manufacture in default. So that level of uh, post installation um, support that we offer is really second to none and we pride ourselves on that. So just to go through the different camera ranges, we have the 5 megapixel colour view range here, um, which that uses a white light based technology built into the bottom of the camera to provide 24-7 colour imagery. That's the same on the 5 megapixel colour view and also on the 8 megapixel colour view here. Um, so what you can expect at night is there, if you have good ambient lighting, street lighting, lights around the property, um, that white light may not be needed. The camera makes an assessment when it sees the, uh, the amount of ambient light that, that is available in the footage. If it is a very dark area, such as a side alley, rear of the property, uh, rear of a factory, etc., then that light's going to kick in, and that enables the camera to see in full colour detail at night, so it can pick out the colour of clothing, faces, um, and registration plates, etc., etc. You have a lot more visible detail available than you do from a traditional infrared-based camera. Um, the, all of the camera systems have a detection um, system built in, so it will notify you on your smartphone of activity when people enter certain areas of the, uh, the shot. Um, on the 5 megapixel range, it is more of a, a basic system, so you can only have it on two of the cameras and it doesn't have any intelligent filtering. So if it detects uh, wildlife, birds, um, you know, cats, pets, uh, inclement weather, all of those things can trigger false alerts. You can expect an accuracy rating of between 50 and 60 percent of the phone. The, uh, the alerts that you get come through to your phone will be accurate. Uh, when you move up to the AccuSense ranges, which are built into the dark lighter and also into the new uh, 8 megapixel color view as well, uh, you are then uh, it's a much more intelligent system. So it looks at the size of the object um, and it's looking for a human or a vehicle type object, and you can decide which one it's actually uh, going to concentrate on. That takes your accuracy rating up much higher towards uh, over 90% on these type of cameras. Um, that's called LiveGuard technology. And the reason um, iVision introduced that is because they were then planning on making the cameras more of an active deterrent. So rather than just recording footage outside the property, these cameras can now take action when somebody enters a particular area. So for instance, on the dark fighter and also on the new color view, you can upgrade the cameras to include a speaker and a light warning system. If then uh, an intruder enters a particular detection area, the camera can then take action automatically by either A, turning the light on or flashing the light, and B, issuing an audible warning message from the camera to say this area is under surveillance. Attention please, the area is under surveillance. Both of those things really should get rid of any unwanted guests from outside the property and the camera is doing that automatically. They can both be scheduled independently as well, which is fantastic. So that means that you can have the light come on, say, after three o'clock in the afternoon or until seven o'clock the following morning to cover our winter time. Um, and then the speaker, you may not want to come on until, say, after midnight, until 6 a.m. when you know that there should be nobody hanging around in those areas. That's a, just an extra level of deterrent. So um, our engineers have set all that up for you as part of the installation, and we can remotely make changes to those times if you want it to operate differently. Um, but they are the ultimate lifeguard technology cameras in the fact that they automatically get rid of intruders. Um, the colour view range, uh, as standard, comes with the light feature built in. We have a new custom firmware for that camera now, so we can actually get the light on this camera to react to somebody coming into a detection area. So, for instance, if you have that come around, uh, camera outside the front of your property, somebody comes into the detection area, uh, we can then get the lights kicking on that and uh, draw their attention to the camera. Also lights their facial detail up so you're getting a much better shot um, of what they were up to. Um, so that's the standard on the colour view uh, range with the, with the custom firmware that we would install on it. Um, both of these ranges have microphones built in, 
So the Dark Fighter and the new Color View uh, Emote Pixel have my audio as standard. The upgrade is to get the speaker and the light. Um, other features between them, you've got full metal body design on both the Dark Fighter and the Color View. Um, on the 5 megapixel color view, it is a plastic design, so just bear in mind when you're positioning those cameras, these need to be in a safer location because they are more susceptible to somebody hitting them or damaging them, whereas these are full metal vandal resistant design. Extremely tough camera, it has a security locking system on there, and nobody's going to be uh, you know, causing uh, damage to those. So um, that's the different types of camera ranges we have. I'm just going to take you over now to some demonstration videos where we will show you the different types of image quality that you can expect from the three different types of cameras during the day and also at night so you can then make a better informed decision about which camera is better for you. Thank you for watching the video and if you need any more help or assistance just visit smartandsecurehomes.co.uk uh, where we have all our product ranges explained.